Yeah, I, I just want to point out some specific um, context on the youth um, identity in the specifically in the tribe like Tawarib and Tubu. Um, the 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 young person in Tubu is surrounding by surrounding by the comprehensive set of social orders uh, that come from the customary law. Tubu they have written uh, they call it constitutions, which is actually customary law. It's a book that's inherited since 19, yeah, early 60s or something like that. Uh, they, they have a sultan, uh, which is they are listening to, to him mostly in their social uh, obligations. Uh, but, um, and this, and, and the, the identity of the young Tubu man is, uh, is a layer of identity. It's, it is matrilineal communities in, uh, in terms of they are Mm, like the mother, mothers in the uh, mothers and women in their life, uh, in the young person life, it's central in his connections. So the young table man will grow up looking to his nuclear family and then to his wife families, uh, to his uh, direct family and his wife, his mother family and his and to his um, uh, wife's family and then uh, his father family and then the clan and then the tribe. So it's a layer of identity. And it's a social obligation he has to fulfill it, which is set the expectation and the way he has to behave in his community. But unfortunately, this set of orders is that he's not a, he's not really entitled to work on it when to work with it in terms when he starts to do what we call it trafficking or smuggling. He is a free man to go and to do this. So it's very it's very important. It's very difficult to use this uh, social uh, layers that's actually, it's uh, very important as a social orders and social control in this absence of security and absence of the governance region to uh, community will be abiding with some kind of law and orders which mm, could be the tribal itself.